Good morning, and welcome to one of the great days of your life. I don't know about you, but I've waited long enough. Anyway, you come up and you get your ring, which is really wonderful, and then they take a picture of you. Jose Castillo. Yeah. Thank you. I didn't know you were a marketer. <laughs> I appreciate it. Thank you. Congrats. Thank you, guys. I don't remember what going on. That's insane. Oh boy. Right? I think I wear opposite my other. Both fingers swinged out today. Did you see these already? No. I know! I was just thinking, you're like, where? Instead of, I don't know. I was gonna give them like, to <laughs> Like Peter, I gave like a big hug yeah. and then I was like, just, like I was like, I guess I'm gonna hug Don for yeah. this is weird. I know, I know. <laughs> Don't really know you. Natural, so that worked out very well. Yeah. <laughs> no, I got it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a it. great <laughs> privilege to be with you all today for this very special moment. Congratulations on what you have done to be here today, what you have dreamed, what you have contributed and what you have accomplished both individually and as part of this incredible group must be celebrated. For some of us, this will be a once in a lifetime event. Believe it or not, a few have done this before, but for most of you, I hope this is the first of more than one. I believe it will be. We don't work for this moment, we work toward the possibility of this moment. We have a lot to celebrate today. Although we are in the midst of another season, today we look back at the incredible ride we all went on together from Christmas until late July. Take a moment to reflect on the historic nature of that journey. Coming off the NBA bubble, no fans in the building for part of the season, to ultimately a capacity crowd inside Pfizer Forum and 65,000 people outside this building during the finals as we celebrated the second NBA championship in Milwaukee Bucks history after a 50-year wait. I mean, how cool is this? Not only are we NBA champions, the best basketball team in the world, we're all gonna get rings because of this guy, because of our ownership group. I mean, how cool, right? No, this guy, for real. <laughs> you know, for, me, for me to stand up here and look out and, and you know, so thankful for all the things that everyone does, um, but it's incredibly and specifically special to see people like Mike Sergo and Dave Babcock and Rita Huber um, Dave Snyder, and I could go on and on and on, Ben Conrad, Dave Dean, um, people have been with this organization for, for a quarter of a century uh, to be able to, to be part of this, for Jim Patch to be able to be part of this. So thanks to everyone. Um, let's keep working. Let's keep grinding. Let's be great people. Let's stay together. Let's do it again. Go Bucks. We got a great, great uh, message here from our coaches and players, too, that I'd love you to all enjoy, um, and then we'll go to a toast. This is Mike on. Is it off? So I hold it between us. <laughs> What's good, guys? It's BP here. Hey, everyone. I just want to thank you for all the amazing things you did for us last season. I uh, appreciate everyone's hard work all year. You guys did a great job. Everyone had a role to play in this thing. We could not have done what we did last year coming down the back stretch without you guys. Your job does not go overlooked by us. Congratulations. You deserve this ring as much as anybody. I uh, just want to say thank you to all the staff, um, everybody that made basketball so easy for us just to have to worry about basketball and go out there and try to uh, play our hearts out. Without you guys, there would be no us. So thank you from the bottom of our hearts and happy holidays to you as well. Look forward to many more of them. And again, thank you very much for all the hard work that goes on behind the scenes. I want to thank you guys for all your help. You guys are incredible. Just trust me, you're going to enjoy this. We want to take a quick second to thank all of you for all the hard work you guys do. Thanks, everybody, for all your hard work that you do behind the scenes. We all have to be stars in our roles, and you guys were last year. Let's do it again this year. Congratulations. Congratulations on getting your ring. 
guys are more than deserving of it. And uh, thank you for all the hard work you put in on our behalf. You know, we couldn't do it without you, and all your hard work doesn't go unnoticed. I want to personally thank you guys for always bearing there for us and having our back and always supporting us. So congrats on your ring and go Bucks. Without you guys, uh, accomplishing a championship last year wouldn't have been possible. So enjoy your rings. Thank you. Go Bucks. Thank you guys for all your hard work. You guys deserve the ring. Uh, enjoy it and uh, show it to your family and friends. Appreciate all your home uh, hard work. Uh, could never do it without everybody. It's an amazing team, an amazing organization. Great for the city. Um, wear that ring proud. Go Bucks. Let's everybody grab their glass. Let's raise it up. To us, thank you, the 2021 NBA World Champions, Milwaukee Bucks. Cheers. We are about to begin the presentation of championship rings. We want to remind you of a few things that are happening today. When you come up for your ring, you will hear Peter and John thank you, and then you will see two flashes. Stick around up here just briefly for a couple of pictures, and then... Can you please stop, Jim? Yeah, can you stop? We'll start with one other one first. Yeah. Let's just start this the right way. Our first ring to our guy, Jim Paschke. That's your ring. Right. Thank you so much. That feels real good. If I might just take a couple of minutes. Exactly 12,819 days ago, I had the privilege of broadcasting my first Bucks game on television. That's a long time. And I want to call out somebody else. He has worked for, represented, and loved the Bucks organization for over 50 years. John Steinmiller, where's John today? Thank you, John. Over 50 years. Each of you has your own unique story. You know, for us, never once was a paycheck or a ring the motivation. However, what this ring signifies is the motivation. It's simply excellence. We have one of the greatest players in the world representing the Milwaukee Bucks and his teammates, and they show us every day what it takes to hope to achieve excellence. And if you do that every day, you can achieve excellence. Let's never forget the lesson that Giannis and the Bucks have shown us in 2021 and before, and they will show it to us again. It's a simple question. What are we doing to get better today, and what are we doing to make the organization better today? So again, congratulations for your contribution to a championship organization. Enjoy the fact that when you wear your ring, you will have many opportunities to tell this great story. The story of this particular Milwaukee Bucks team, the long storied history of this franchise and what it means to our city and our state, and quite frankly, the world. And you will be able to tell the story of the fans of this franchise. 
what we saw from those fans during the finals and during the playoffs should be etched in our brains forever. They showed the world how to do it right. They represented the organization, the city, and the state in the best possible way. We can always tell that story. That's what this ring will do for you. People will ask about it. They'll want to know all the stories. That is the legacy of what is happening here today. It has been my honor to be on your team. I haven't had a chance to thank the organization. Many of you in this room have helped me every day over my 35 years so that I could be standing here with you today. It has been my distinct honor. Thank you so very much. Okay. Show it off, Abby. Awesome. Oh, wait, you probably want it this way. Yeah. There we go. The champion. I want to see the man's ring. Go Bucks! 21 spins, whatever year it was. <laughs> nice. So which finger did you pick? I did the middle finger. Yeah. There we go. That's nice. That's nice. I like that. Yeah, last name it should be on. Oh. You alright? Yeah. Yeah. So, how does it feel to be a champion? Feels amazing. You got two rings, don't you? Very expensive hands you have. 